Hi there, uh, Debbie here, and it's my 51st birthday, yay! Um, we had kind of a triune birthday, or quadroon actually. Um, it was my birthday, and my grandson was five, my grandson RJ. My other little grandson turned one, and my puppy turned 12 weeks old, all on the 8th. Well, actually, Nathan, the little guy that turned one, was actually on the ninth, but he was only three hours late, so, you know. So anyway, it was a good birthday, and I might attach a few photos at the end of this. Um, actually, I really, I haven't made a video for so long, I don't really know what to say. Except that turning 51 isn't as dire as I might have thought it was going to be. I've recently acquired a social life. Uh, I've actually went bowling and went a few other places, which isn't bad for a person who is basically agoraphobic. Uh, I guess I'm feeling a little safer out there in the world. And you know what? Somehow I think that YouTube may or may not be responsible for this. Uh, it's probably a good thing that I've been able to make friends and talk to people. Um, my subscribers, the people I subscribe to, you know, a lot of them I'm getting to feel like I kind of know, you know, as well as a lot of my other friends. Life hasn't been real bad the last week or two for me. Um, I've been actually too busy to make videos, but I have been um, watching my subscriptions closely and appreciating my subscribers for hanging in there. I got a beautiful call from my brother today and that was really, really nice. Um, as I said before, life is not as dire at this age. I'm feeling actually younger than I did 10 years ago. My daughter tells me I look younger than I did 10 years ago, which is awfully nice. Uh, nobody, you know, enlarge it or anything, because you might find a wrinkle or two, and at this angle, it doesn't look so bad. Uh, I don't, actually, there's a poem I want to read, so I'm gonna do that, I think, about now. What Will Matter by Michael Josephson. Ready or not, someday it will all come to an end. There will be no more sunrises, no minutes, hours, or days. All the things you collected whether treasured or forgotten, will pass to someone else. Your wealth, fame, and temporal power will shrivel to irrelevance. It will not matter who you owned or what you owed. Your grudges, resentments, frustrations, and jealousies will finally disappear. So too your hopes, ambitions, plans, and to-do lists will expire. The wins and losses that once seemed so important will fade away. It won't matter where you come from or on what side of the tracks you lived at the end. It won't matter whether you were beautiful or brilliant. Even your gender and skin color will be irrelevant. So what will matter? How will the value of your days be measured? What will matter is not what you bought, but what you built. Not what you got, but what you gave. What will matter is not your success, but your significance. What will matter is not what you learned, but what you taught. What will matter is every act of integrity, compassion, courage, or sacrifice that enriched, empowered, or encouraged others to emulate your example. What will matter is not your competence, but your character. What will matter is not how many people you knew, but how many will feel a lasting loss while you're gone? What will matter is not your memories, but the memories that live in those who loved you. What will matter is how long you will be remembered, by whom and for what. Living a life that matters doesn't happen by accident. It is a, not a matter of circumstance, but of choice. Choose to live a life that matters.